What can I do? What can I do to brighten them off, you know, to put them off? How can I test them with stuff like So that's how each obstacle came. And each year they came back. <laughs> in they'd go and they'd do the challenge. And that's really, that's a great description, that is, of how tough guy created tough guys. Today, the bulk of the challenges lie in the final few miles. A gauntlet of 25 or so obstacles aptly named the Killing Fields. That's where you'll find the Death Plunge, Torture Chamber, Underwater Tunnels, Battle of the Somme, and others. The event's most formidable obstacle, however, has always been the cold. That is tough. It's minus five in there today. It'll be a little bit colder on Sunday. Traditionally, the event is held on the last Sunday in January. Mother of God, how cold is it? Why would you do that to us? No surprise, hypothermia has become a real danger at Tough Guy, one that Mr. Mouse understands all too well. Hypothermia is a solid killer, total killer. No stranger to the brutality of the course is James Appleton, a three-time champ. In addition to being one of the world's best obstacle racers, He's a daring landscape photographer who treks to risky and remote corners of the planet for the perfect shot. Yet even he is humbled by the conditions at Tough Guy. When you first turn up, your first reaction is to want to walk away and to think, I'm not going to be able to do this or I don't want to do that. The way this whole thing's been set up and the way he runs it each year is to provide the hardest, most brutal, most suffering level during the actual event as possible. So he won't break the ice. He'll put the path right through the middle He'll send you in straight away so that you're breaking through ice in minus five degree, you know, outside temperature and winds. The whole thing is designed mentally and physically to just break people. And it doesn't hold back in that regard. There's no messing about. There's no gradual easing in. You know, you get thrown in the deep end and you're expected to stay there uh, and do your best to get to the finish. 